Hello and welcome to Gary's Mod Death Battle. Today we have two super powered combatants who've beaten their foes time and time again Melonman from Bad Water Videos 2009 and Spider Scout from Scattergun 2013. Let's get on with the analysis. Note, we are not including Spider Scout canon from other sources, we are only using Scattergun's variation. Starting with Mellerman, he is a very powerful person. Melonman was able to fly from a building in Badwater to the lower area of the map. Trying to measure the distance based on my, somewhat inaccurate, analysis, the distance is approximately 14.728 meters, excluding the vertical distance. Melonman traveled that distance in 4 seconds. The speed formula is Speed equals distance slash time. Using that formula, we can conclude that Melonman's flying speed can reach up to 3.682 meters per second. A little behind the average running speed but enough to dodge most projectiles. Remember, my analysis is not definite or accurate in any way. In conclusion, Melonman is a very mobile individual. This is not over however, we are not yet mentioning his combat abilities. Melonman possesses melon bombs at his disposal that he can launch towards enemies, as shown in Melonman to the rescue, there is no known limit to his ammunition so let's assume he can spawn infinite explosive melons. This alone can make us assume he's at least Wall Street level. Melonman isn't lacking in hand to hand combat either, he's shown to overpower teeth and ear with fists alone. Let's not forget his intelligence, Melonman is quite a skillful strategist, being able to detect oncoming danger and weaknesses in any fight. For example, he was able to conclude that his melon bombs would detonate nearby gas canisters so he resorted to his fists. He has also shown to be very alert to danger, he displayed this when he noticed and deterred a bomb from teeth and ear. Overall, Melonman has proven to be quite agile and competent in average combat. Moving on to Spider Scout. Spider Scout is actually very powerful, his web abilities can stick to any surface and is capable of serious damage. Spider Scout is capable of web swinging like the regular Spider-Man. This affirms that he is quite mobile, and can get into hard to reach places with his webs. Although it hasn't been shown to be used, Spider Scout also carries a scattergun, a pistol, and a bat with him, which can be utilized to finish off enemies. But most importantly, Spider Scout's most dangerous weapon is his raw strength. He was able to throw Heavy several meters away from his original position. Heavy himself has wrestled bears with no problem and lugs around a 330 pound minigun at all times. This has shown that Spider Scout's immense raw power can outclass heavies in any situation seen as Spider Scout did it so casually. Spider Scout is no joke. And our winner is Spider Scout. This fight could have gone multiple ways but in the end, it all decided on if Melonman can dodge Spider Scout's webs or punches. Spider Scout is practically better in basic combat, his overwhelming strength and accuracy has proven to be much greater than Melonman can handle. His other weapons alone proves to be a great threat. Melonman's only option of winning is to land some melon bombs on a vulnerable Spider Scout but that would be quite difficult because of Spider Scout's ability to travel quickly via web slinging. If Melonman can dodge long enough, he could potentially tire Spider Scout and launch a bomb once he's vulnerable but the chances of that are slim to none thanks to Spider Scout's never-ending barrage of attacks and versatile arsenal. Our winner is Spider Scout.